Today's math lesson is about writing or translating phrases such as y fewer than 35 or the product of 9 and k into mathematical expressions. And as always, if you still have questions after watching this video, please leave them in the comments and I'm happy to help you out. Let's start with a phrase that means addition, 12 more than a number x. There are several words and phrases that can mean to add, so I listed a few of the most common ones in this table that I created. I encourage you to make one for yourself and keep it as a resource to help you if you need it. The key phrase here is more than, and I can see by looking at the table, more than means to add, but this phrase also has the word than in it. The word than in this phrase means to reverse the order of the numbers. So instead of 12 being the first number, the variable x will go first instead, and the expression will be written as x plus 12. All of the other phrases listed in the table would not have changed the order of the numbers. Let's look at those next. I'm going to use the same number and variable 12 and x in these key phrases listed here above. The algebraic expression for all of these keywords and phrases is 12 plus x. Now let's look at some keywords and phrases that mean to subtract. I again listed some of the more common ones here in the table. Starting with the keyword minus, my phrase is y minus 35, which I think you will agree is pretty straightforward. The algebraic expression will be y minus 35. And these next three keywords and phrases will also result in this same expression of y minus 35. Now, these last three phrases will result in a different algebraic expression other than y minus 35. Let's look at fewer than first. Do you see we have the word than in this phrase? Remember the word than reverses the order of the numbers. So the algebraic expression will be 35 minus y, not y minus 35. These next two phrases of less than and subtracted from will also be written as 35 minus y. The words than and from reverse the order of the numbers or variables in the written algebraic expression. Now let's switch to multiplication. I listed the three most common keywords and phrases in the table. Let's look at the phrases using the number 9 and the variable k. All three of these phrases are pretty straightforward. The algebraic expression is 9 times k. You can use a dot to represent the multiplication sign, but you cannot use an x because it looks too much like the variable x. You can also remove the multiplication sign in between the 9 and the k and just write 9k. The last operation I'm going to look at is division, and my table is now complete. Since I've run out of space in the table, I'm going to write the phrases here below it. The division is pretty straightforward here, but the most common mistake that people make is not following the order. Division does not have words like than and from in its phrases, so you need to follow the exact order given in the phrase. Since the number 7 is before the variable m, 7 will go first. And the algebraic expression for both of these phrases is 7 divided by m, or you can write it as the fraction of 7 over m. Here are a few expressions to try on your own. Write your answers in the comments and you can check yourself with the answers in the description. And if you found this video to be helpful, you can buy me a cup of coffee by clicking on this link in the description.